In the quiet town of Ravenswood, a dark legend loomed over its unsuspecting residents a chilling figure known as the Hat Man. Said to be a harbinger of death, the Hat Man appeared to those on the brink of their final moments, a haunting omen of impending doom. The story began when Sarah, a young woman plagued by strange dreams, woke one night to find the Hat Man standing at the foot of her bed. His shadowy figure and piercing red eyes sent shivers down her spin. Paralyzed with fear, she watched as he pointed a bony finger toward the door, silently foretelling a fate she could not escape. Terrified, Sarah sought solace in the town's local historian Murr. Johnson. He revealed a dark secret that had haunted Ravenswood for generations the curse of the Hat Man. Legend had it that anyone who encountered the Hat Man would soon meet a tragic demise. Determined to break the curse, Sarah gathered a group of brave friends who were willing to face the malevolent entity head-on. They delved into the town's dark history, unearthing old records and dusty manuscripts that held clues to the Hat Man's origins. Their research led them to a dilapidated mansion on the outskirts of town believed to be the epicenter of the curse. As they entered the decaying halls a sense of foreboding hung heavy in the air. The mansion seemed to come alive, its walls whispering secrets and its floors creaking under unseen footsteps. Each member of the group began experiencing eerie encounters with the hat man. He appeared in their dreams taunting them with visions of their impending deaths. The veil between the supernatural and the living world grew thin, as the hat man's presence seeped into their waking hours. Driven by desperation, they sought the guidance of an enigmatic psychic known as Madame Leclerc. With her ancient knowledge and connection to the spirit realm, she revealed that the hat man's power was derived from a cursed artifact hidden within the mansion a black obsidian mirror. As the group ventured deeper into the mansion's labyrinthine corridors, they faced their worst fears brought to life by the hat man's influence. They encountered grotesque apparitions, nightmarish illusions, and witnessed the tragic fates of past victims. Finally, they reached the heart of the mansion, a hidden chamber housing the black obsidian mirror. But their mission was far from over. The hat man materialized before them, his sinister grin sending chills down their spines. With every passing moment, their grip on reality waned and their lives hung in the balance. Summoning their courage, they shattered the cursed mirror, breaking the hat man's hold over Revenswood. As the shards scattered, a blinding light enveloped the mansion, banishing the malevolent entity from their lives. The curse was lifted, and the town was freed from the hat man's deathly grip. In the aftermath, the group came to realize that their encounter with the hat man had changed them forever. They had stared into the face of death and emerged victorious, bound by a shared bond and a newfound appreciation for life.